Apple ITR here, and today I'll be going over 10 more awesome must-have jailbreak tweaks compatible with iOS 12. Now all of these tweaks will be listed in the video description below, along with their sources. With that being said, let's get into it. The first tweak I have to show you guys is called V Wallpaper 2. Now this tweak was previously updated for iOS 11, but I've found the work on iOS 12 as well. This tweak allows you to set video wallpapers on your home screen and your lock screen. As you guys can see, I can set video wallpapers on my lock screen and my home screen. You can download V Wallpaper high resolution video wallpaper packs from my personal repo here. This link to the repo will be also in the video description below. The next tweak I have for you is called Jellyfish. Now this tweak redesigns your iPhone's lock screen and gives it a special look. As you guys can see, my lock screen has been redesigned with Jellyfish, and this tweak is looking really nice with V Wallpaper 2. The next tweak I have for you is called Color Flow 4. Now this tweak will colorize your now playing music interface in Apple Music and Spotify to match the color of the album artwork. This tweak will work for the now playing background, the text of the interface, and much more. It works on the lock screen, music app, and the Spotify app. The next tweak I have for you is called Pencil Charging Indicator. This tweak is simple and will give your iPhone the special pencil charging indicator from the iPad Pro when you plug it in. The next tweak I have for you is called Nougat Folders. Now this tweak gives the folders on your iDevice a cool look, as you guys can see here. The next tweak I have for you is called Notifier Dots. Now this tweak gives you awesome app icon notification indicators in your iPhone status bar. Notifier Dots is configured in the settings where you can choose the apps it works for. I have it turned on for Snapchat, Messages, and the phone application. Whenever you get notifications for these apps, the icon will appear like so in the status bar. The next tweak I have for you is called Eclipse 12. Now this tweak allows you to change the color scheme of most applications in the settings and includes a midnight mode. As you guys can see, I have midnight mode turned on and I've applied it system-wide to many applications. The next week I have for you is called Notamask. Now this week allows you to disguise certain notifications as if they are coming from another application. As you can see here, I'm in the Notamask settings and I wanna turn on disguise for a certain application. I'm going to do that for my text messages or iMessages. I'm going to now choose a fake application. I have chosen Pokemon Quest. I can now edit the message of the notification to something custom. As you can now see, my message notification has been disguised as a Pokemon Quest sale message. The next tweak I have for you is called LockDroid. This tweak allows you guys to get the Android style draw to unlock lock screen on your iDevice. Colors and settings can be configured in the system settings pane. And as you guys can see, I'm drawing to unlock my iDevice right now with this tweak. The last and final tweak I have for you guys today is a simple one. It allows you to disable closing out the music app or any app of your choosing when the music app is playing. As you guys can see, I have music playing right now, and I simply cannot close out the application from the app switcher. This allows me to quickly close apps without killing my music by accident. So those are all the tweaks for today, guys. Hope you enjoy them. Make sure to drop a comment, give this video a thumbs up, and please subscribe. I'll catch you guys in the next one.